Hey guys, it's Nathan New 52 here, back with another Injustice Gods Among Us after show. I do believe we're up to season 1, episode 17. So we've almost finished the season, but don't let that fool you guys. I'm still popping out videos better than ever. And if you do want to know why this video is a bit late, I have two reasons. First reason is because Airshare hat the device, I, the kind of, kind of app I used to download to record my screen, sorry is kind of faulty and also I've had a bit of a cold so uh, I still have a bit of it now I've recovered a bit but if I stand a bit sick it's uh, because I have a bit of a I have the flu I have a bit of a cold so let's get into the video our question today will be is reverse is reverse flash worth it so if you don't know reverse flash is uh probably one of, one of the hardest characters to get in the game other than obviously characters like that you can't get like, uh, like uh, let's just say, uh, Red Lantern, how Jordan can't get him anymore. Obviously, he's one of the more rarer characters in the game, I would say. And his passive is called Cellular Regeneration. While active, the Reverse Flash has a chance to immediately regenerate health and cleanse negative effects after taking damage from a special attack. And this may occur three times every match. So, even though he is the Reverse Flash, he still has the flashes. Support card, altered perception for 10% health, 10% damage is lightning quick, and a speed force for 10% energy regeneration. So, yeah, basically, he's just another alternation for the Flash. Here he is, he looks pretty cool. And uh, is he worth it? I'll tell you why, because he is pretty rare to get. If we look at the booster packs, uh, we've got he. Ways you can get him, the first way is from the most wanted pack, and the second way is you can get him by reaching top 5% in online battles, which is really hard to do. I would definitely rock, not recommend getting him that way. You know that I don't like doing online battles. It's just way too hard, but let's see if we can get him. And uh, we can't get him. We got a Shazam, that's pretty lucky, but you can see how hard he is to get. And this pack costs 600,000 too, so that's that's pretty hard. As you can tell, I cannot get him, and I'm not, I don't want to waste all my money, so I'm not going to... I'm not going to waste all my money, but this is a very rare chance you can get him in the most wanted pack. So, yeah, basically he's really rare to get. So today I'm going to be going through if he is worth it or not. If you should spend your money, your effort, basically all your injustice life on this guy. Sp Lightning Kick is his special attack number one. Out of time is his second attack. And Speed Zone is his super move. Now, uh, yeah, basically, I have him at Elite 7, but he is at level 35, so he's not at full capacity yet. But he has decent damage and health, so let's look at him in gameplay, and just basically how he plays. Let's get right into it. So let's get into a battle. Let's find some opponents, and let's see how Reverse Flash plays. So, let's find him on my top damage. He should be pretty high. Because he is a decent character. Yes, he is. He's still not maxed though. But let's put some good gears on him. Let's put the Rage Uncle Scimitar. This. And let's also put this. Okay, guys. We have got some gears on him. And now let's get into a battle. We also have back air on our team. Which means we start with an extra bar power. Which is just more useful for us. So, yeah. Because he's a flash character, he's very easy to use. He, he's easy to. His heavy attacks are really good, fast, powerful to use. See, there they are. And, uh, yeah, here's his light attack, Combo Wonder. And his first move, it's called Lightning Kick. And once, if you do a Lightning Kick, it'll, it'll make him go faster a bit. So, see, if you, you won't notice now, but uh, he's getting faster. So, that's pretty cool. But now, let's look at his second attack. It's called Out of Time. It's a rapid tap. And let's look at it. And he blocked it, but it looks like that, basically. It's like a three-part attack. But only one rapid tap where basically he just does some random stuff to a opponent that requires super speed to do. Oh, and here's cellular regeneration. See, he he regenerated from that attack. So that's pretty powerful. Out of time again, I'll show you what it looks like again. But basically, you, he, it's a very useful passive. One of the best passives in the game, I do believe. So, yeah, it's very useful. See, stun. If I've been stunned and I... Okay. Looks like cellular regeneration didn't activate. So that's one of the rare times where it won't activate, but when it does activate, it's very, very useful. And another way you can use Reverse Flash to his like full capacity is if you keep doing lightning kicks, what will happen 
is basically he'll get fast and faster until he he gets like really fast that he just can't be stopped so that's really powerful once you know what to do there's celery generation again from solomon grundy swamp hands so that's very useful lightning kick guys and boom victory is right there as you, and you as you can see he's a very 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 useful character obviously he has his epic moves he's got that epic passive and also he's just a general good character because he's a flash variant which means he can attack very fast even even if you use his light hit when you use his lightning kick over and over again he gets really fast so in survive mode he's very useful obviously he has his celery generation so shield toss it'll do a bit of damage it's very good for uh regaining health and it's one of the one of the best or may if not the best uh defense passive in the game and this will all also cleanse negative effects so yeah let's see let's see okay i'm bleeding a lot but if i do celery regeneration i will stop bleeding so that's basically cleansing negative effects and you can see how fast reverse flash is going just by going like this see look because i've got done all them lightning kicks so she gets really really fast even if she blocks it i get really fast see you can see i'm going significantly faster than i did before obviously because i've got see you just keep doing lightning kicks he gets really fast and then he'll just get like see he's just way too op when he's super speed right never go never try and stop a character with super speed they're just way too op they're going way too fast so that is a very very useful guys another way you can use his powers to his full capacity so yeah guys a very useful character i definitely like using him and he's one of my all-time favorite characters on injustice gods among us so yeah out of time again see okay there are lots of reasons i could keep going there's a list on my reverse flash is one of the best characters in the game obviously you got his excellent defense passive you got well you got his epic special attacks and then you got like his fighting style is just so good but one question is he worth it like i said before he's extremely extremely rare to get and you're gonna have to buy a lot of most wanted packs to get him and like i said before definitely oh if you are if the only way you could get him is to keep doing online battles i would definitely say that he's definitely just not worth it anything that you have to do online battles to do is definitely just not worth it for me that's just my opinion guys you might have a lot of time up your sleeve but i do not have a lot of time i personally believe that it's definitely not worth it it requires a ton of energy and time to do online battles so if you want to get a reverse flash from online battles i would de heavily heavily recommend not to because obviously he's very online battles are just way too hard so definitely don't go for him in online battles but uh, most wanted well this is kind of a hard question because he is he is extremely rare he's is very very rare in the most wanted packs and uh yeah well it depends if you have the money or not because if you have a ton of money and you just keep buying most wanted packs you're bound to come across reverse flash one time or another so you might as well just go for him if you have like a ton of money that you don't want that you don't need and you just want some reverse and you and reverse flash is a good character don't get me wrong it's just the ways that you can get him is white white it's way too hard to get him so yeah what i'm saying is most one packs yeah if you have the time if you have the money definitely go for him because he is one of the best characters in the game but he's also one of the rarest to get and that's why i definitely think he's good he is a good character but uh there are just he's just way too hard to get if you know what i mean he's one of those characters that are utterly utterly op but are way too hard to get like he doesn't have his own challenge challenges are an easy way to get good characters but he does not have his own challenge so that's not very that's not very good you have to get him from online battles on most one packs which is the like the hardest way to get characters so yeah guys that is my answer if you agreed or if you didn't agree uh please let me know in the comments it, uh please don't criticize me this is just my opinion you can have your own opinion it doesn't matter and also guys if you have a if you want to submit a question for next time on justice after show we're nearing the end of season one so i'm just taking in all your suggestions please let me know in the comments below because that would be great greatly 
appreciated. Also, be sure to check out my friends' channels. Their links will be in the description, as well as the links to the first, uh, first 16 now. First 16 episodes of the Injustice After Show Season 1, so be sure to check those out. Absolutely amazing, guys. So, yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video on Reverse Flash and the Injustice After Show Episode 17, because I certainly did. And, guys, I just hope you have a great day, and I will see you next time, guys. Bye.